Just Sarah McKenna, weather from where you live. Good morning. We have seen the rain showers move across our area. We got quite a bit of rain out of it. You can even see a few more showers now going through the Winnemac area, going down into Delphi as well. These are very light in nature, however. You'll also notice a little bit of a wintry mix into the counties to the west. We saw a little bit of a snow or sleet throughout those evening hours. As for the rainfall totals, we ended up seeing just under three quarters of an inch of rain here in Lafayette, which is still a good amount of rain for just the past 12 hours. Temperature right now, 37 degrees, so it is on the cool side. It feels even colder, of course. The wind right now, 13 miles an hour, making it feel like it's 29 degrees out. Across the region, you see all the rain moving out of our area. Again, we could see a few more of these little light uh, showers or snow showers throughout the morning hours. I do expect to see all that kind of clear out as the system as a whole moves away from us. You will notice, though, the clouds stick around. Precision cast showing you clouds throughout the day today, throughout the evening hours tonight, overnight as well. And then they're going to kind of stick around a little bit for Friday. I'm expecting mostly cloudy to partly cloudy conditions. They do start to clear out more as we head into Saturday. You can see the clearing there, too the west. So for today, mostly cloudy conditions, windy and cold, 38 degrees for your high, which doesn't sound too bad. We've been there, but the fact that the winds are going to be 15 to 20 miles an hour continue to make it feel like it's in the low 30s or 20s, so it will feel below freezing pretty much all day today. Tonight, it drops below freezing, 23 degrees. The clouds are going to stick around very cold. Then for tomorrow, it looks like not quite as windy. The clouds are expected to linger. Again, it's going to go back and forth between mostly cloudy and partly cloudy. So expect to see a few more peaks of sunshine. 34 degrees for your high. And while the wind's still pretty uh, strong there, 15 miles an hour, it's not near as strong as what we experienced for today. Take a look at the rest of your seven-day forecast. You can see... Saturday, absolutely the day that's expected to be the coldest one here. The high gets just barely above the freezing mark. You're low into the teens. But Sunday looks to be dry, just cold, but we can handle cold.